everybody, welcome back. Today I'm gonna to be talking about how to take your dinner on the go and keep it warm. Or more importantly, if you made it early because you have a ton of meetings, you're working from home, you make it at lunch, these things will keep it warm until you're ready to eat, even still in the same pot that you cooked it in, which is fantastic. So I have two different sizes here. The brand that I really like is Hot Logic. This is my third one of this smaller size and my second one of this larger size. They do break down after somewhere, or if the cord, your kids accidentally shut it in the car door. That does happen. So this smaller size here can fit an eight by six Tupperware in it. I'm talking glass to make sure that it stays, um, it doesn't melt on the hot plate because it does get really hot. And you want to make sure that that Tupperware is not taller than two or two and a half inches. That way you can zip this up and grab it by the handle and carry it with you as you go. This one is also really nice if you're using saucepans on the stove. You can just leave it open like this. If you're eating at home but just need to cook a little earlier, you can leave it open like this on the counter, plug it in, and it sits right there and keeps the entire uh, pot or pan, whatever it is that you have on here, warm. So this is the small version of the Hot Logic, which I will link below. I also have the large casserole size here which is 13 by nine that it can fit on the hot plate. And again, you wanna make sure that the casserole dish is about two to two and a half inches tall when it is closed with that top lid on it. It has the same functionality, it has the zipper. This one does have a nice mesh pocket on the front. I will tell you if you put any utensils in here that are metal, they heat up just as much as the hot plate and then you can't grab them, which is a bit frustrating. So don't put any utensils in that mesh plate and the mesh pocket here. So there are two different options that they now have. The one that I have, which was all they originally offered, was for the AC outlet, so what you plug into your house. They now also offer one that has a cigarette lighter um, extension here so that you don't have the option for AC. It's just a cigarette lighter for the car. I personally like having these plugs because, like I said, if you're making dinner early, you have lots of meetings, you can put it on these and it keeps it warm. You also have the option to use these for parties that you're having where you cook in advance and then you're you know, greeting people and having a good time being social, but all your food's already done and it's just sitting on this or in a casserole dish and this that you can keep warm and then transfer it to the table or to the buffet, however you're doing it. So if you are going with the AC option, what I would recommend is a power inverter like this one here, which has one plug in it and attaches to your cigarette lighter. Now this is if you do not have a car that has an AC outlet. I know my husband's car has an AC outlet, so I don't need this in there. Um, this is also nice because if you have multiples of these, you can put one in the trunk, you can put one in this, wherever you have the cigarette lighter outlet, you can plug this into. I will put the link for this below. This is a 150 watt power inverter. I've had this specific one for I think four or five years and haven't had to replace it. Again, it's not going out of the car. The reason why I have to take uh, have had multiple replacements of these is because they are constantly going from car to the field to a hockey rink to the table they are going everywhere the kids use these as their plate they put them on their lap and then they eat out of them sometimes so they take a beating and they keep on going so I will put the links for these below I highly recommend having at least both sizes for traveling uh, if you're doing multiple people eating when you're traveling, the larger one is a nice option because I can fit smaller glass containers in here, which portion out everything. So one for each kid plus myself, the larger one is a much better option for that. If you're just trying to bring a large dish and don't need anything more than an eight by six, this is also a nice option. So this is how I managed to get home cooked meals everywhere with me always finding an outlet everywhere we go because this is a really great way to bring home cooked meals and not have to pay or go to a fast food joint when you're traveling or if you're doing sports where you can't be home for dinner because that does happen. If you have any questions on these, like I said, I've been using these for about five years now so I can answer just about anything you might ask. Please put your comments below and follow along with us as I try and help you. Make sure that you stay in the kitchen and stay out of the fast food lanes. Enjoy the rest of your day. Take care.